They're costumes you can't buy at a store. I was doing eight hour days for the last couple of weeks trying to get it all covered. Hosted by drag queens Fatsy Klein and Barla Jean Merman. Careful. Look at all those feathers. The annual Bourbon Street Awards held on St. Anne and Dauphine Streets attracts crowds to see who has the best drag and leather. It's a uh, fairyland in City Park. So we did Mother Goose. The three little pigs. I'm with the crew of Armenius. We did the infamy ball last Friday, and I represented Tokyo Rose. We did famous crimes in history. I believe in gay Mardi Gras, and it's important to keep the traditions alive. Dressed as Bloody Mary, Joseph Oden Miller sees some of the most elaborate costumes here. You'll see more creativity and talent poured into this than anywhere else. It's a lot of makeup, though. <laughs> has been a Fat Tuesday tradition for decades. And after a year off in 2021, the contestants had even more time to create the most elaborate costumes. And that's why everything's so big this year. We've had two years to plan. We were all ready to get out. We start the Sunday after Mardi Gras. So this has been a year and a half in the making. About six months of work. This costume took about six months to make, starting with the wire work, uh, a little bit every weekend, uh, while you put the pieces together, bought the fabric, made adjustments, found sequins. The city runs out of like all these supplies. And this year especially, contestants and spectators alike were eager for the flashy, colorful show. It's cheesy. It feels like home. It feels right. Erica Ferrando, Eyewitness News.